Welcome to Bedtime Story. Today we are going to read a very packed stuff in Christmas by Disney. It's Christmas Eve at McStuffin House. The presents are wrapped, the cookies are baked, the trees are covered with bright light and shiny ornaments. Everything is ready around perfect McStuffin Christmas. You know Santa can't come until everyone asleep, Mom says. Doc and Donnie race out of their room and jump into the bed. Night, Bugumbo, Mom says and kisses Doc on the forehead. As soon as the mom closes the bedroom door, Doc holds up her stethoscope and all her toys came to life. The toys are just as excited about Christmas as Doc and Donnie are, but they know Doc needs to get to sleep. As soon as Doc's eyes are closed and the toy get to work, Operation Doc present is underway, whispers Hallie, jumping out of the bed. Just don't wake up, Doc. Lambie cry, carefully picked up the Doc presents. It's a homemade ornaments with a picture of dog toys. Now they just have to get it on the tree in time for Christmas morning. Shh, Hallie tells Lamb to stuff feet and they tip toe through the hallway. You two are louder than fireworks at the football game. But that's not us, Lambie tells Hallie. It's that elf under the tree. Oh, Jingle Bell and Candy Canes, wails the elf. Now I have been seen too. This night cannot get any worse. Tobias of the elf introduce himself and tell the toys why he's sad. It's been a busy year, so Santa has a team of elves to help him. But I dropped this present and the toy inside broke, Tobia explained. If Santa finds out, I'm worried he wouldn't let me help anymore. The toy all smile. They knew Tobias came down the chimney of the best toy fix upper there is. They just have to wake her up. Doc head downstairs to meet Tobia. Oh no, she gasps when she sees the broken toy. That's Commander Crush. The toy Donnie is waiting for. I know, Tobia says. He's written Santa at least three letters. And I have watched him to do so many kind things. Tobias, don't give up so easily, Doc says. I just need to give the commander to check up. Doc grabs her doctor bag. She checks the commander ears and eyes. She listens to his heartbeat. She looks at his back. This part is broken, Doc explains. I can't fix, but you need a brand new one. Luckily, Tobia knows where they can find a replacement part. You have to come with me to the North Pole, he whispers. And with a little sprinkle of elf magic, Doc, Tobia and all the toys are transported to Santa workshop. That's where I built, Commander Crush tells them. That's your pl- what's your plan? Why with Tobias? The toy building room, Tobias replies. If we can get in there, we should be able to find all the replacement parts. Tobias leads everyone to the back way so Santa won't see them. There are train track and springs, these springs and slippery slide in the toy building room. But there aren't any space bought parts. 
they head to the next room where they'll see space bot i have a great kid waiting for me commander kirsch tell the space bot that's fine doctor here is prepared to fix me but we can't find the part toy likes us but get put together in our own room the space bot like him great doc cheers let's find your broken part and then fix can then i can fix you finally we make it to the space bot room doc looks in all bin extra legs extra wings card joints she says then doc finds what she need a bin full of extra gears okay are you ready for maintenance doc asked commander kirsch affirmative he replied doc gets to work and put her new part in place commander kirsch spread his wings and transformed into spaceship i did i did it he cries no wait you did it thank you doc to be starts to cry again but this time he's crying happy tears all i ever wanted to make kids happy on christmas he says ho 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 blooms a voice behind toby it's santa claus oh santa i am sorry i broke donna's toy say sorry i have been watching you santa says you did everything you could to make sure donny has a perfect christmas you are just the kind of elf i need the, the tobia surprise santa promoted him to jingle bell a group of best and the most important elf in the north pole then santa takes a look at commander crush back who fixed you santa wondered i did doc says i am doc mcstuffins ho 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 of course you are santa laughed i have been following you career for a long time i have never seen a kid love and take care of her toys as the way you do you have a job at the north pole if you ever want one doc appreciates santa offer but she won't trade her family her toys for anything well we would better hop in my sleigh it's almost morning says santa space tastic says commander crush and let's hurry so donna can get her best present ever me jingle bell jingle bell and the rain is down the hall santa sleigh so far through stopping sky fill with snowflakes and dog muffin get home just in nick of time dog has a good bye hug to give before she goes inside i couldn't have saved donna's christmas without you dog toby says or gotten to join the jingle bell i've always been watching you on christmas the next morning donna's jump and dog beds to wake her up santa came he came donna cheers and i got the best present ever dog follows donny downstairs to celebrate with her family i love my present too she tells the toy holding up her ornament there is one more present there for you dog hali whispered dog opens up the box to find the best present ever it's her very own jingle bell elf toy but how did mom and dad know then dog read the card on the box dear dog from one toy lover to another ho 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 merry christmas santa